dun 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 there this is a hurricane durian update right now hurricane durian is now on the coastlines of right here hurricane warnings have been issued along these coastlines an evacuation immediate has been issued for Jacksonville even the parts of Georgia and South Carolina let's read what it says Millet Mandatory evacu hurricane evacuation for Brewfort County ordered for tomorrow at noon. Mandatory evacuation. All schools and state eight government officials will be closed beginning Tuesday. And now let's read the one for Georgia. Weather update number six. Georgia. Actually, I'm going to have a, somebody else read this. Hold on a minute. Okay, Paul, tell me what's going on. Weather update number six, GIA amenities and app. Offices closed weather update number six, GIA amenities and app. Offices closed effective immediately given the current mandatory evacuation ordered by Governor Kim. All Jekyll Island Authority amenities and offices will be closed effective immediately. Closers will continue until further notice. Please continue to refer to the Glen County EMA Facebook page and the Jekyll Island website where GIA representatives will continue to provide updates on the evacuation and closures. Thank you, Paul. Now back to the alerts. Now let's read the evacuation order, order for Dalville County, Florida. Paul, tell me what's going on. Mandatory evacuations for Duval County Zone A and Zone B, along with residential properties located in low-lying areas, and for all manufactured homes. Residents who live in Zones A and B should begin to make the necessary arrangements and prepare to leave starting Monday, September 2nd. Shelters will open at 10 a.m. Monday, September 2nd. For more information, including a list of open locations and items to bring, visit jacksready.com. Citizens with special medical needs are asked to register with our emergency preparedness teams at ca.net slash special medical needs or 630 city. Citizens must pre-register if they plan to stay in a special medical needs shelter during an emergency and must re-register every year. Duval County Public Schools will remain closed Tuesday, September 3rd and Wednesday, September 4th. The cities of Jacksonville Beach, Atlantic Beach and Neptune Beach have temporarily closed the waters of the Atlantic Ocean, meaning no water activities are allowed until conditions are deemed safe. If you see someone in the water or attempting to go in the water, please call 911 immediately. The City of Jacksonville's Emergency Operations Center, EOC, remains activated to track storm progress and prepare for potential impacts from Hurricane Dorian. Citizens are encouraged to be aware and continue preparations. Mayor Curry has asked citizens to stay tuned to local news outlets for updated information, to check the city website and Jack's Ready mobile app, and to call 630 City 2489 for additional information and assistance. End of message. Thank you, Paul. We will be continuing to keep track of this storm as it continues to go through the coastline of, of Florida, up north, and the Georgia, and in the Carolinas. I'm your host, Famous Mapper. We will be back for more when any updates.